This is a walkthrough video of 407 South Tuttle. Tuttle's a busy street. Um, we're on the corner of Louise and Tuttle. We're really close to downtown. Um, Ringling is just a couple blocks down and that's where, that uh, takes you right down to the center of downtown. This house is auction property on Hubzoo. It is, um, needs a lot of work. It's a wood framed house. Uh, I'll tell you the roof, needs a roof, needs a lot of TLC. Um, funny thing about this, there's no, there's no driveway. Uh, no driveway, no garage, no carport, nowhere even to put a car. Um, so I guess over here you could, I don't know, put some gravel down and park a car there or build a garage, but I think that's asking a little much, but, um, you know, windows are terrible. I'm going to, I'm going to have a tough time finding anything nice to say about this house. So, um... You know, there's past roof leaks in the ceiling. At one time, this was a pretty cool room because it has a cool plaster ceiling. Uh, this is just wood paneling. Yeah, I guess it's wood paneling all the way around. You know, strangely enough, that AC looks like it might even work. That that is that's that's interesting. So we got the AC right there. Um, this is a laminate flooring. I walk into this room, I step down into this little room, which is all wood. Seems like I've been in this house. The kitchen is um, as you would expect. It's actually not terribly disgusting in here. It is relatively clean, but it's certainly yucky. Uh, it has appliances. I guess this at one time was the garage because I just stepped down. Maybe there was a garage and a driveway right there. In fact, I can see maybe there was a driveway right there. And this at one time was a garage. And it's been converted into a bedroom. This is indicative of some, some rot problems. This is where the water heater is. Water heater, strangely enough, looks good. This is a plug for a washer and dryer. The panel, the panel looks okay. Um, this is a was a pocket door that goes back into the kitchen. Um, you, know, you could almost, I mean, fix it up and rent this thing as is, almost. Probably was a rental. Bedroom number one, very small, with a closet. More paneling, more paneling. The, the uh, laminate ends and we have some linoleum in here. We have uh, some plumbing issues, plumbing leaks. This is all just really collapsed and pretty bad. That is the bathroom over there. That's uh, been leaking for a long time. These windows are all broken. You know, Jalouis windows. That's Typical. Um, that's bedroom number two. This is the only bathroom. <laughs> look at that tub. Uh, look at this toilet. You know, the tile surprisingly looks good. <laughs> Almost. And so I think, but that's really has to be redone. Um, this is bedroom number three, also small. Looking out to the backyard, there's a little covered porch, which I will show you. It is, um, so it's three bedroom, one bath. Uh, there is a little closet here, a little closet. And this is a busy street, it's on Tuttle. I have one for sale down the street at about 215 and um, probably about what it'll go for. It's a great location, being close to downtown. I mean, adding it up, you're going to need to spend $50,000. Because it's going to need a roof, it's going to need plumbing, it's going to need kitchen, bath, flooring. Um, you know, $50,000 might cover it. But just kind of show you the backyard here. Actually, a nice tree. It's got slow overhang. Electrical meter. But this is what the siding is. This is probably the biggest concern 
you know, all this siding, it has to be scraped. And probably can be okay. I mean, surprisingly it looks, I mean, as bad as the paint looks, I don't see, I mean, I do see some rotted boards like right there, that's rotted. A lot of the siding really needs to be replaced. Um, some more pretty bad rot. And it really needs to be scraped and painted. You might get away with scraping and painting it and just fixing a lot of stuff like this. And you got a nice little bee's nest in there. Hi, bees. There are bees in there. I hope I don't get stung. But there's a bee's nest right there. They seem pretty happy. Um, so, yeah, 50,000 50, is what it's going to take. And that's not doing it super well, it's doing it, it's um, making it okay. But I think if you were into it for, if you got it for 100, and you were in, put 50 into it, you could sell this for over 200. So I'm Jules Roman, Yorkshire International, 941-366-0000. And as always, thanks for watching.